why do i care to worship kala bhairava kala bhairava represents the highest and the most valuable categories for both the universe and as far as your personal life is concerned he embodies the principle of time time as represented as kala bhairava functionally by the ancient uh, civilizations by saying ancient civilizations i do not mean in a derogatory sense that these people did not uh, know anything other than gods and goblins gods and goblins are more real are more relatable more workable more profitable to work with so i'm not going to go into that but let's go back to time as you can understand somebody came to see me from richmond driving 3 hours and i told them what happened to the space and time when you were traveling they were both integrally involved if you had a helicopter it could have gone it could have uh, gotten here in half hour or 20 minutes but you took 3 hours why what happened when you took a helicopter you speed it up so speed is related to time and space time and space is not simply some new understanding that einstein brought it was of course was very important to bring time as the fourth dimensions because the other two dimension of length width and height are indeed about only space and the fourth is time and it is very difficult to conceive of time he did a wonderful job no doubt about it but then the uh, even more wonderful more powerful more profitable is good to kala bhairava the god of time the god of space the god of time is also mind so the god of mind so he will give you a super space a super mind and a super time maybe if i'm to time or autos time all these are possible with kala bhairava and there is no need for you to go study einsteinian physics which of course you and i can't understand so what we can understand and relate to and get benefited from is kala bhairava and shake hands with him and then he is going to simply disappear the disappearance of kala bhairava on december 30th according to the anbalayam.com you may want to visit that site it is on uh, the 30th which i agree so the disappearance means that he is going from the disappearance of the mind the disappearance of time you will be timeless you are you are mindless then where what will you be then then you will be like god god has no time god has no mind Well, no division so it will be just fantastic and how do you live this that's the most important thing you have to live kala bhairava how do you live kala bhairava you have to apply him to everything you think about because you think about everything in a very limited time bound space bound mind bound categories that's the principles you cannot think something outrageous okay uh or a space also for system stations all of them are related to so when you plan your event you have to do in two ways one is time bound which is yourself the bound enslaved by lower level of cognition and behavior 
yeah, you know, I'm going to be in Christmas, means this place. Our Kalo Bhairava is going to disappear on 30th. That's true. That, that exists. I'm not saying that you have to give up. You cannot give up even if you want to, because DC is far away from here, a mile. I have to travel an hour to get there, so that's not going to disappear. Maybe I, I can take a helicopter and get there quick. But anyway, you have to, whenever you, you apply this to every everything that you do in your life, then you will see that you are not constrained. You are not putting limitations. You've got to do it. Like, yeah, this is what my planning is. But uh, I'm open. Open well. Open to what? Kalabhairava. Kalabhairava, I'm open to you. To give you heavenly life, divine life, not bound by rationality, by three-dimensional space, or by anything. Kalabhairava is boundless. He disappears. There's no mind in this. So that is going to be a great thing. And even by lighting just uh, a candle for Kalabhairava every day, and then just say, Om Kalabhairava Yanama, Om Sarma Krishna Bhairava Yanama, Om Kalabhairava Yanama, Om Kalabhairava Yanama, Udhyamo Bhairava, Udhyamo Bhairava, Udhyamo Bhairava, Udhyamo Bhairava. Thank you, Kalabhairava.